Hey guys, uh, super quick video. I promised I'd put this up, so I'm just gonna put it up now. I've seen a ton of videos regarding um, Predator's uh, Hunter Trap, and I'm just gonna show you uh, pretty much the tightest version that I've found so far uh, that negates wake ups, and the only way to wake up on it would be like an x ray. Now, uh, I have to do this quick because I did this video twice over and my audio didn't record correctly, so uh, this is gonna be my last shot. Here we go. So I'm going to show you guys my corner carry setup that goes into an armor break uh, and gives uh, grants him another combo. Let's take a this. Oh. Let me also set the wake up attack to slippery slide. Let's take a look there. So that is an armor break to the time. And I did it a thousand times. Now, I'm going to do a thousand and one times. I'm going to do that. Bam. That breaks armor. It cannot be blocked uh, once they start the, the wake up. It does look like it on combos, but that's because the uh, combo meter doesn't count this. Uh, so let me show you what you get if you successfully break. You get that. You get uh, pretty much 42%. Doing it too early. <laughs> well, as you can see, it's pretty consistent. Uh, the reason I chose Reptile is because he's the hardest wake up to do this to in the game. Because it low profiles, it's forward advancing, and if you get it consistent on this, you get it on everyone else. Alright, last try, because I got a run. Okay, look at that. Do something simple like that. Straight up 39. Well, you get more than that. You get 42, really. But uh, that's that's pretty much what it looks like. You get a good uh, reset for them trying to wake up. Now, this is a tighter trap. The most important part about this is doing 3-2. Once you do 3-2 at the end of a combo, this will, uh, this will not combo the same uh, when you have good gravity on it. Other hits like this will combo all into it if you're doing it at the end of a combo and it'll like throw away the trap. Now, you want to do EX because EX is, it starts up right away. Um, it's instant. So if, if a character also wants to stay down, the beauty of this setup is that you're safe you are safe and you get the attempt now if they try to wake up with anything they they get destroyed if they stay there they're gonna stay into more pressure you can even do stuff something like this uh, where just to be safe if you don't want to risk it against uh, one of these uh, wake ups that are not forward advancing I repeat you just blow it up and see what happens you know, um, I believe you can even do it with a regular one so you don't have to waste a meter Let's take a look. Learn together. Yep. There you go. So, if you don't have meter, you can toss one down and detonate it before it becomes active. So, uh, in a sense, Predator does have, you know, he has a way to do all this. Now, he can run it back. Um, let's say you have three meters. You've already used two to, to do anything into this combo. Let me just get into the corner so I don't waste my time with this. You uh get everything into this combo, right, man? Yeah. Anyway, you guys already know what I'm saying. So there, since you end it with 3-4 again, you can just straight up go for another one. Bomb trap. Yeah, <laughs> I called it bomb trap. It's 
actually right here. So he tried to lay down and gets hit. But if I set him to pick up, he should be able to get the same exact situation. There you go. And that's that would be the corner setup. Now it does require a meter, but uh, it's definitely worth the situation. And it's it's super tight. It's much better than doing uh, the two little jump punches because um, they have options to try to jump out, and it's uh it, it can be blown up by wake up. But now I know that's a guessing game, but with this you don't need a guessing game. Go right into it. So yeah, that's it for now, guys. Uh, had a much longer video, but I uh, got really lazy after my audio didn't record the first two times. I'll be putting up uh, more max damage stuff and uh, more predator attack uh, within the coming week when I have time. Peace.